version 11.5 wow how we go into the future of industry welcome everyone to another update 70 million downloads these numbers are getting so big that i just i can't sort of like understand or visualize them anymore also another thing i can't understand or visualize whatever behemoth culling is main mission section as well okay well let's take that as our first little clue of what to do and have a look main 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 oh yes no presumably it's this clear five behemoth or bear moth depending on your sensibilities culling stages for the first time check about challenges to confirm target stages ancient egg 101 ancient egg 102 Let's follow the next breadcrumb then. About challenges. About, about? About down here. I found it. Right, okay. Ah, here we are. Look. Behemoth culling maps. Hidden forest of Gapra. Ashvini Desert. And Jinfori Volcano. All right, fair enough. <laughs> Will any of this be here when I look? Oi, what are you doing? What's this? <gasps> iOS devices that are not running 11.0 or later will not be able to play. I can't imagine that many people are stuck on a version that old, but it is a difference. It is a change. Do let me know if you are one of those cool antique people. Proclaim it proudly. You are fighting back against consumerism. Well done. Anyway, let us move on and make money through people watching my video and gaining advertising revenue. Ah, no, no, look, it's here. It is here. There's so many things, actually. Wow. Jinfori Volcano. Of all the ones to come up, I, I am understandably glad that it is this one. It's got a kind of lovely little wolf next to it. That, I guess, is the behemoth or bear moth symbol. One clear until the stage disappears. Well, that's fine. And heck it, why not? I haven't been on Battle Cats in a while. Let's just put all of the items on, because I am a verifiable madman. Let's go. Magma Tunnel, Area 1. Ooh, no, that is nice. We've got lovely little, little glowing bits of ash or, you know, whatever the actually scientifically correct term for those bits are. There's a little animation in the background of the, oh, ho, ho, of the magma just going bloop. That's lovely. I like that very much. But let's have a look at these z -b -z -z guys at the moment so far, or not. Thank you, Sniper the Cat. Bit of a calm start off. Oh, that's the wolf. Oh, golly, that's really cool. I love that. It's an unkempt doge with lots of spiky hair. <laughs> he looks rather like me. Well, that, that'd be a shame to destroy myself in this way, but I think the only thing this can possibly call for is the Shadow Gal. Now, I don't know if this is actually a normal type enemy. I may be being bamboozled. Let's find out. No, it is. It is a normal type enemy, but it has strength on it. And it looked for a brief moment like it was going to cause us trouble there, but it must have been on so little health that we just destroyed it anyway, which is great and fine and, you know, doesn't, doesn't bother me in the slightest. Next, Zippo, um, with its just it, it, its jawline concerns me because it, it it's not complete, and that's sad. Oh, you know what? I, I tell you, like, I'm loving these different enemy types. They are pretty funky. Like, I, I really don't quite get what's going on. But if you know me, you know that I like to be surprised by things. And this is a great surprise. What a lovely, rich colour of orange. High def, can I add. Thank you, Ponos. And its animations are so smooth. Compare something like what we're seeing unhelpfully obscured by the Albrow to an Arost say, which is all kind of onion peel lines of speed. It's definitely smoother. You see more of the motion of this orange thing. And it, to be honest, it looks great. I don't really mind that it's sticking around and killing my stuff because, well, firstly, we're not getting trampled by it. And secondly, it's kind of pretty beautiful. This is the high quality enemy design that I'm all about. Thank you very much, Ponos. Very nice indeed. There's also red sparkles, which again, high def and very animate if that means anything, which it doesn't. But I don't know what they represent. It's another of those many advances that have sort of gone past me because there have been a few updates that I've missed or a few updates that I've gone on to and gone, wow, okay, I am at the very best quite confused. 
So that's just going to be something that I'll have to accept. It's not damaging us massively. This is, again, only the first area, so, you know, probably that is the reason why we found it relatively easy. But nonetheless, the enemy is defeated. We are successful, and we are going to be able to find out what comes next, or at least be teased as to what comes next. So that's our Magma 1 done. Let's find it again. It's gone! Like actually fully gone. Oh, it's like the um, the Aku ones where they disappear and then you come back another day and do a bit more. So that's them. Puberty Doge with its hair. What else is there in terms of new and news? Not in there. Where is it? It I. Come on. You can, you can tell I haven't been on this in a while. Oh no. Right. It's this menu again. <gasps> That was actually fairly painless. Hurrah! New Evolve item, Behemoth Stones. Probably should have brought a, a, the treasure radar on me actually thinking about that. But you can use these stones to enhance certain heroes. Collect these as drop rewards from the culling events and Hunter's Map Enigma Stages. So, Enigma Stages, right? You can get Hunter's Map Enigma Stages, a new type of Enigma Stage. Now, Enigma level cap is raised to six. I presume that means that you can get six stages at once. The cap seems to have been four here. However, if I'm wrong, the other thing it could be is a different type of Enigma difficulty. But I'm going to go with number you can hold. Oh my goodness, I've just seen something quite exciting. Trickster Himiuri has talents. We can't show any of the, the true form because it is a girl and monster that we don't have. But somewhere, somewhere within here, probably over here. Is it over here? It must be. Must be. It must not be. This is too far. This is collapse. Where? Where is it? Where? Where? Where is it? Where? It's. It's not here. What do you mean? It's not here. I don't understand. It. It needs to be here. I definitely have Trickster Himiuri. It's trickstering me. Okay, so fun facts, guys. I don't have Trickster Himiuri anymore. Right. <laughs> I wonder if something's gone wrong here. Just assuming that I'm not blind. Because we have got a little bit of a text wrapping error here. Has it also deleted one of my Ubers? Or am I stupid? Uh, vote glitch or stupid in the comments now. Perhaps we will have a little bit better luck in looking at the other unit with talents. Because that should definitely still be here. It is Little Flying Cat with talents. Oh, it can target Relic. Curse immunity. Curse. Defense buff. Attack buff. Oh. That could be interesting and, you know, pretty good because I'm not getting any of those strange cat fruit true forms. So this talent could prove useful as we move further up into the Uncanny Legends. Stay tuned for that one. We've got high difficulty stages. Of course we have. More Uncanny Legends. And new user rank rewards. Woo! Here they are. Yeah. Look at that. Oh yeah. Limited invasion stages added for certain catamin stages. I, I, I have no idea what that means. Let's have a look, see if we can work it out. Possibly Aku? No, no idea. This game is getting so complicated that even the update notes don't <laughs> don't really tell you what's happened. Let's let's use our blessed new filter in the combos. Um, new cat combos? Apparently not. I I thought they're all supposed to turn up now. Um, so. That suggests to me that it would be a bug. Bug or blithering idiot? Vote in the comments section now. Well, looks like that will do it for update version 11 5.0 date. It's, yeah, it's got some things in it. I'm just getting a little bit of a culture shock, I guess, from just how much I don't understand anymore. I feel like an old man. Oh god, I've said that before. I've said exactly that before at the end of an update video. And I didn't realise until after I'd said it. Oh no. I'm gonna go and have a lie down. I'll see you all later.